In this WebEasy hosting tutorial, we will go over adding exceptions to your AVG antivirus and firewall, as occasions may arise when the security software conflicts with your WebEasy professional. With AVG open, click on Options. Choose Advanced Settings. Exceptions will need to be added for both the Programs folder and the Documents folder locations. To do this, click on Exceptions. Click on Add Exception. Choose Folder for Exception Type. Click Browse to locate the folder you are creating the exception for, and locate the WebEasy folder by going to your Documents folder, commonly located under your C drive, in the Users folder, the Username folder, and finally under My Documents, you will find the WebEasy folder. Select the WebEasy folder and click on OK. Click OK once again to add the exception. Next, add the WebEasy program folder. Click on Add Exception again. Again, choose Folder for the exception type. Click Browse. Expand the C drive directory. If you have a 64-bit system, you will see Program Files x86, in which case you will go into that folder. If you do not see the x86 folder, it means you have a 32-bit system, and you can choose the normal Program Files folder. Next, locate and expand the AvinQuest folder and highlight the WebEasy Professional 10 folder. Click OK to select the folder. Click OK to add the exception. And then click Apply to finalize the two exceptions you have just created. A window may populate, requesting your admin approval to confirm the changes. If so, click Yes to apply changes. Click OK to return to the AVG home screen. And now that the exceptions have been added to the antivirus, we will need to apply similar steps to the firewall. Click on Options. Choose Firewall Settings. In the left-hand menu, choose Applications. You may already have the rule in the list. If you do not, click on Add. Click on the Browse option to the right of the path field. In your File Explorer, locate your Programs folder. This is in your local C drive. Again, if you see Program Files x86, choose that one. If not, select the normal Program Files folder. Go into the AvinQuest folder. Open the WebEasy 10 folder. Scroll down and select the WebEasy program. Click Open and then click Create. It will prompt you to select an application action. To keep it simple, make sure it is set to Allow. Click OK. Once more, click Add. Select the Browse option. You will still be in the WebEasy Professional 10 folder. Scroll down a little bit and open the Website Host folder. Next, open the WebEasy Site folder and select the We Host Publish Wizard. Click Open. Click Create. Again, ensure the application action is Allow and click OK. And your two firewall rules have been added. For those of you who already had the rules in the firewall list, if they are set to anything other than allow, double click on the rule and ensure that the application action drop down is set to allow and click OK. Lastly, click apply to finalize the exceptions to your firewall settings. Again, click yes for administrative approval of the changes. Click OK to close the window, and you may need to give administrative permission to proceed again. And that's all there is to it. As always, if you have any questions, you can reach us by phone at 855-490-0540, by emailing support at webeasyhosting.com, or by starting a live chat at webeasyhosting.com. Thanks for watching.